lot of people think that cats can't be trained. Well, they can. As well as dogs, as a matter of fact, and then sometimes cats can do a lot more than dogs can do. For example, we're going to show you a video of Kit going potty on the toilet. Have you ever seen a dog do that? I haven't. But we're going to start with something that dogs commonly do. Sit and stay. Okay, Kit, if you're ready, come on. Come, come, come on. Good boy, good boy. Over here. Good boy. Okay, sit, Kit. Sit, sit, get your butt down. All the way down. Good boy, stay, stay. Good sit. Good sit, Kit. Okay, in case you're wondering why he does that, he likes the meat. I call it chicken, but it's not really chicken, it's beef. Anything that's a good treat is known as chicken. Cats like to dress up. I've taught many, many, many cats to wear outfits, and they really like it. I think they enjoy the attention they get when they dress up. Here's a photo of Kit and I going to Home Depot last night. He goes with me a, a lot of places where I go. He goes shopping, he goes to restaurants, he goes on errands, and in the restaurants, of course, they make him sit on the patio. They make us all sit on the patio, which Kit thinks is highly discriminatory. In training your cat to use the toilet, a lot of times people say, well, what's the secret? How is a cat trained, and why is it so easy? The way they're trained is through habit. Cats are creatures of habit, and you train them by helping them to develop a sequence of habits. Four, to be specific, there are four habits, and a cat learns them sequentially. Good boy. Do you want chicken? So that the final result is the potty habit, which is why he goes potty on the toy. Good kid. Do you want chicken? Leash training a cat is an easy thing to do. And it's a very good thing because if a cat can walk on the leash, he gets to go outside with his owner where he can do all kinds of exploration and the cat is safe from coyotes because you've got a handle on him right there. Uh, when you first start teaching your cat to walk on a leash, it's a good thing to either have a treat or a non-food treat such as a toy or a stick so that your cat um, can follow that and can be distracted by, um, by the toy and then he won't realize that he's wearing the leash or the halter. Some people say to me, well, my cat just lies down. I try to put a leash or a halter on him, he just lies down. Well, you learn to distract him in the beginning and after a while, he doesn't even care. Does Kit look like he is an unhappy cat? No, I don't think so. I guess to wrap it up, the one thing I would say that comes out of the training process is the fact that after a while, and it's really not a very long time, you start looking like your pet. Or maybe your pet starts looking like you. Have a look at this photo and tell me what you think. Can you see that Kit and I bear a resemblance to each other? Do we? Or is it just my imagination? Hey, kitty. Sorry, old guy. Sorry, big guy. You look like your mommy.